What's up everyone? Welcome back to the Durbin Compound. If you haven't met me already, my name is Devin Durbin. So today on the channel, we're carrying on the playlist with the best workwear. Uh, we did boots, we did socks, and now we're into some pants. So I'm going to throw a cheap option at you. I hope you're enjoying your Saturday and let's get going. Alright guys, I don't think I can make a very long review out of this, but I might bump my gums for a little while. These are the Dickies Flex Pants. Um, you can get these at Walmart. You can get these anywhere Dickies are sold. Um, the big reason I like that you can get these at Walmart is they're cheap and you know they're kind of a dime a dozen when it comes to workwear. Um, so th these are right about, you know, depending on which ones you get, these are the 874 work pants. Um, these come in right at 25 bucks. I've seen $30. I've seen um, as low as 22 at uh, Rural King. So these are a very cheap pant. Um, you will spend less on these than you would on a new pair of Wrangler jeans um, or something like that. So I really like these pants. Um, they are, you know, your standard, your standard zipper and button at the top. Uh, they're a regular boot cut at the bottom. So they're, they're straight leg boot cut at the bottom. Um, they don't um, do anything out of the ordinary, um, nothing flashy, no skinny jeans. Uh, you know, some, some work pants you get just, their, their fit is horrible. I really like the fit of these. I really like the material. Um, as you can tell, the knees uh, get worn out easily. Um, this, uh, I think they call it brown, or this would be duck brown. Um, you can see the wear on these. Uh, which is not bad. I mean, the, the, the wear is not really that big of a deal. Um, if you work in your pants, you're going to wear them out. Um, the edges of the pockets stay uh, very, very good. Um, I know they wear out uh, on a lot of pants from tape measures, stuff in and out of your pockets. Um, the one thing that I would like to change on this uh, is a deeper pocket. So the only thing that I have bad to say about these pants is your front pocket is um, is not very deep. So I put my phone iPhone 8 um, down in here <clears throat> and that's literally the bottom of the pocket. So as you can see here um, it, it kind of you know it, it's not all the way in the pocket. So it, it basically you know, if you're wearing these it kind of sticks out. You can see how, how much your phone uh, sticks out when you wear them. So uh, anytime I'm around sawdust or anything like that, I have to turn my phone upside down. Um, obviously, I'm recording with my phone, so I just have my case here. But um, you know, I have to turn my phone upside down so I don't get any dust in the, um, you know, in the bottom of it. So turn it upside down because it is exposed right there on the edge. So that's the only thing I don't like about it is it's not deep enough for the bigger phones these days. Um, but, you know, is that really a big deal? It's really not. Um, these have held up really well. Um, I carry stuff in this pocket back here on the back of the pant leg every day. Shows no sign of wear. Um, I'm always keeping my knife, flashlight, pin, sharpie, and uh, yeah, pin, <coughs> pin, sharpie. Apparently Rambo's mad about something. Uh, pin, sharpie, flashlight, and knife always stay in this little pocket here. Um, on your passenger side or whatever you want to call it. Um, uh, these have held up really well. Uh, I do have one pair that has worn out the crotch. Um, the crotch is, is, uh, is triple seamed in the back, double seamed in the front. Um, if you look at it from inside, um, it's double seamed on the inside. Uh, I've just worn out the fabric in one set of these pants. Um, you can see where you know they start to wear here. So not really a deal breaker for a $30 pair of pants. If we were talking about a $100 pair of pants, um, maybe I'd be a little bit, uh, you know, mad about it if it wore out after, you know, a year. But these pants are pretty darn good for the value. Um, they hold up very, very well. I've never ripped them. I've never worn them out other than the crotch in one set. But, you know, when you have, I think I have eight pairs, when you have the crotch wore out in one set, it might have just been... Uh, a point where I stretched, uh, I I stretched it or I stressed it, and you know it just came apart. So, 
you know, out of out of eight of them, only one did it. I'm I'm pretty pretty satisfied. So for thirty dollars, uh, by all means, go out and get yourself a pair. Um, like I said before, these are the Dickies Flex. Obviously, I'll put it in the thumbnail. I'll put a link below in the description. Um, some of the different places that you can get them. Um, do your own homework. Uh, get the best price that you can get. Um, I highly recommend. Um, they fit pretty much natural to your regular sizes. Um, I didn't have a problem with them being too small or too big for that size. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoy your Saturday. Give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down, whatever you're into. Uh, and if you haven't clicked subscribed already, please consider that subscription as it would be very important to me and it would really help me out. So I hope to see you guys in the next video and yeah, that's it. We'll see you.